Hey guys, welcome back. This is Bernardo, and uh, actually installing a PCI uh, card, a gigabit actually. And the only reason that I'm installing a gigabit on this particular machine because I'm trying to get VMware uh, installed into. I'm trying to build a EXXI server. Uh, this is actually a Vetro 410, which is supported, but for some reason the onboard NIC is not being read during the installation and if there's not a NIC uh, adapter that uh, VMware likes it will not continue doing the installation which is one of those bummer things um, the only reason that we're building a VMware uh, server or EXI server actually is because we need to build a uh, virtual appliance for our Wi-Fi actually our WAM uh, analyzer software kind of thing so this is a card It's actually a uh, one gigabit card real cheap I actually got this in staples so let's just jot it in there slowly and hopefully it fits goes in with no problem hopefully it doesn't crack there we go like this stuff anybody could do it doesn't you don't really need like a, a master's degree to do this stuff but as long as you guys have patience, you can actually uh, do this anytime. Just gotta make sure it's inside that slot. Because it actually is two slots. Uh, come out. Uh, there it goes. There's this slot, this slot, and there's another additional slot right here. So I'm trying to get that in there so it can fit real nice and smooth. go there we go like that and let's uh put the screw in if i remember where i put the screw uh -huh. where did i put the screw at no one of those things here's, here's the screw make sure this is screwed up real nice and tight That's it, guys. This is how you install a PCI card, actually a gigabit uh, network card, PCI card. Uh, I'm pretty excited. Uh, next step is to cover it up, uh, boot it up, get into the BIOS, disable uh, the onboard NIC card, and make sure that the BIOS reads it. If not, I probably need to install the drivers and get it up and running.